Hello and welcome back here on my English YouTube channel about my Lego City project called Brick World. And today's update was the third birthday special update on the German channel. And that's what you're watching today. You can see that very ugly gap here in the Brick Bank mock building. And that's the place where we are going to build an Italian restaurant today, including lots of minifigures, lots of details and of course lots of lights. As always, I'm starting with yeah, testing some stuff. That's the entrance. I have that sticker and I also started to work a little bit with some details here. You can see that red uh, curtain here. You also can see how I'm testing some stuff for the entrance here with some different uh, hinges and other little details. And also um, the sign here, it's a, a sticker from an official Lego set, I think. I'm not sure at the moment, but I think it's an official Lego set. I think it's a nice little sticker that I can use here. And here you can see that red curtain done with some um, slopes and some um, other stuff. And it's just connected with one little um, yeah, connection point here. And it makes a nice looking entrance with that curtain. And I think it might look very very nice and here you can see me bending over the uh, table and you it's a perfect um, possibility to see how big that is and it's not so easy to see that when you just have the camera filming it but when somebody is standing in the city or next to the city you can really see how big everything is and here are the first results just added that entrance you saw just a few seconds ago and also testing building all the other stuff here the outer wall of that restaurant uh, the left part is something i already did months ago it's that was before i moved uh, to that new location with my city and now some little details once again i have these little tiles and all these other parts and these are fitting perfectly in that location right here filling up that little gap from my um, arches here and I think it looks very nice adding some more um, details with these um, um, bricks here and yeah, it, it creates a nice looking old touch but that's not everything I want to have I also want to Add some modern style that will you see it's just in a moment but once again you can see how big it is I'm standing here and that's one of the reasons why I'm not working at the moment at the old city because I have to have to have the ability to get to that place here and now I added these lies looking white windows here that's adding a much more modern touch to that restaurant. We have that old looking um, outer part and then these modern looking windows. I think it's a very nice combination. You also can see the printed part here is from a German shop. You can see the stairs coming up to the upper part because the um, restaurant will have two um, floors, one with the restaurant itself on the lower floor and on the upper floor there's going to be a bar in one of the next updates and now I'm working at the inner part. You can see the very big bag of white uh, bricks here. That's something I got from the Lego pick a brick wall in Nuremberg. It's uh, not so far away from me, about an hour by car. And I'm using a lot of these now in that building, as you can see here. Also started to add some um, columns. I also started to work here at the kitchen on the right side, the open kitchen, so everybody can see what's going on here. And also you can see the first tables and all the first uh, chairs for all the guests to come. You can see the cable coming here for the upper um, connection to the upper location for lights. And yeah, that's the basic layout for the inside. Now we have the very first look from outside and I think it will look very nice when the light is on and all the people are sitting inside eating. Coming back to the topic of the kitchen, I'm using these printed parts here for the kitchen. They are from the, I think, from the Fab Five official Lego set. It's a great set to use all the parts from it. And now 
we have one finished um, lower floor we have the uh, the woman here working in the kitchen we have all the guests here we have now 12 new um, people here in our city it makes uh, st more than 730 minifigures now in the city you can see all the little details here people eating drinking talking chatting wh whatever whatever and as you can see from outside I think it looks quite nice and it looks it will look much more nicer later and we're adding the lights but for that we have to finish all the walls here we have to build a little bit higher as you can see here it's finished i added another two layers of um, light bluish gray bricks and then i added all these tiles and one some of these modified tiles to make it possible to add the next floor on it like a note from the modular buildings and here you can see that's a connector for the lights going up it's uh, yeah, from the light system from light my bricks and i get it from my german district Distributor illuminate your bricks. It's the same system, but it's a German reseller just another name But that's the final yeah, Lower floor of our Italian restaurant. So what do you think? But that's not all for today Just starting to work at this. Yeah roof or the ceiling and also for it's the floor of the next and also adding these little uh, lights outside of it because I want to add some more light um, at the outside of the building also you can see here all the lights going around for the inside some strip lights some point lights some LEDs as always and I think that's a perfect combination of lights to make it look very very nice in our Italian restaurant and you will see it in just a moment and here it is night mode in the Lego city here in the brick world as you can see we have three spotlights outside making a very nice lightning outside and we also can look now into the building and I think it looks very good I also think we got a very nice um, combination to the left side or here from the brick bank and I really like that combination that brick bank in the front and that Italian restaurant on the um, back side of the building and yeah that's the first yeah the first floor and the Italian restaurant is done that's a very big gap that have been closed today in this update but not all for today because we are just working a little bit more at the second floor we are not finishing it but just starting to work at the outer walls here and you can see these um, sand green uh, windows i do not have all the glasses i have to build uh, to buy some more to make that done in a future update but everything else is done here and that's the final view for today just added some more parts on the top and to have the right and the equal height as of the other side of the brick bank and now you can see how much we have added in today's update there's no interior of course in that second floor the bar is being included in one of the next updates also can see that door here coming from the other building that me it's a door because in the upper floors there are apartments in both buildings but you have only one um, a way to go up in that uh, 10 uh, colored building and then you're going to the other building uh, just through that wall and then you can go to the other apartments and that's it in a night in a night mode once again of course it's a little bit dark in the upper side um because there's no light at the moment but that will change in the future but you have a very nice look now of that very big update of that um building co combining the brick bank mark and my Italian restaurant and of course there are going to be as I said some apartments I think we are going to add two more floors on top of it with apartments in the future but that's it for today thanks for watching today and bye